Okay guys, this is iTech Technologies. Hamza is here back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how to update PS4 with your phone. So guys, without wasting of any more time, let's get straight to the point. And guys, of course, you're going to need any, you know, smartphone. Right now you have uh, this Android and um, first you're going to need to go to the Google and just search the PlayStation 4 update and just tap the first link. So this is the link from the official PlayStation. And guys, this is the legit way. If you use this method, you will not lose any of your data. So yeah, guys, when you open this website, uh, you have you know this kind of interface and when you scroll down you can see we have uh, two options and uh, the first one is it says a ps4 update file and the second one is a playstation 4 installation file so you're gonna need to download this uh, ps4 update file because we are updating the ps4 and guys if you download the ps4 installation you will lose all of your data so make sure you download this uh, ps4 update file and guys you can see the file is downloading and it will only take few minutes or a few hours depend on your internet connection and now you can see my file is successfully downloaded on my this android phone and uh, this method works perfectly fine with any iphone as well and guys the next thing you're gonna need is any usb if you don't have link in the description from amazon you can get many usbs right now you have this uh, 16 gigs of uh, kingston usb and guys the next thing you need to complete this process is this otg adapter it depends on your phone if you have a type c port then you need this adapter or if you have a micro usb then you're gonna need this um otg adapter with micro usb and guys in case if you don't have link in the description and it also helped my channel if you buy something from my amazon link okay the third and last thing you're gonna need is this micro usb cable and guys make sure that you have the legit one that compatible with your ps4 because sometimes some uh, you know micro usb cable they don't work with the ps4 for somehow but uh, if you don't have as i said earlier link in the description so guys so first you have to connect this otg adapter to this uh, android phone so first make sure you connect this adapter and then connect them uh, you know USB otherwise if you connect the USB and then connect the OTG adapter sometimes this will not work so make sure first you connect the OTG adapter and then connect the USB and when you connect the USB uh, there is a notification it says um, Kingston USB drive and that means this drive is working perfectly fine this flash drive and guys you can see in uh, my you know uh, files there is one more option it says um, USB storage and guys next we have to create a folder on your USB so you just need to go to the create folder and name this folder ps4 and make sure you use the capital words so you have to create a folder from the uh, you know usb so this is the folder i just created and then you're gonna need to go to the ps4 and guys again you have to create a folder and make sure you use the you know capital words and just name this folder update and after that just save the folder so we just uh, you know created two folders the first one is ps4 and the second one is update so you have to create two folders like ps4 and update so yeah we just completed the first step and the next step is you're gonna need to move this uh, file that we just recently downloaded it so just move this file from the phone to this usb drive so let me just move this file and uh, uh, make sure that you enter this file to this update folder and guys it will only take few seconds so guys this is the file that we just recently downloaded it from the playstation so guys now this file is in my usb drive so that's how guys uh, you have to move this file from this uh, phone to this uh, you know usb and now guys let me just show you the next step that we have uh, to do with your ps4 so for this purpose guys you have to connect this uh, uh, you know micro usb cable uh, to use the controller and guys as i said earlier some micro usb cables didn't work with the controllers so you have uh, to check out if it is working or not if it is not working then you have to purchase and of course link in the description so you can purchase it from there and guys the next thing is you just have to connect this usb and after that you have to connect the second end of this micro usb cable to this controller and guys it is a little bit difficult for me to uh, you know record the video but you just need to connect this ps4 controller so guys now what you have to do is you just need to hold this button uh, until you hear the second beep so you just need to hold this button for almost 10 seconds until uh, you just hear the second beep and guys when you hear the second beep that's mean your ps4 is in uh, you know safe mode and let me just show you how the safe mode looks like so guys it says connect the dualshock 4 controller so let me just uh, you know press the ps button and guys now there are many options but you have to go to this third option where it says update system software so just tap the enter button and guys now there are three more options but you have to go to this uh, first one where it says from the usb and just tap ok and uh, you just need to wait for a few seconds and this is the file that we just recently downloaded and guys if the ps4 copying this file from usb and it will only take few seconds if you do all the steps right 
and uh, you just need to wait for a few more seconds until this uh, coping is uh, successfully complete and now guys you just need to tap the update button and guys the same method works fine with the iphone you just have to download the uh, update file from the playstation website and just copy the file to the usb and then uh, connect the usb to your ps4 you don't need any pc or laptop for uh, this method and guys that's how this method works without pc or laptop you just need your phone android or iphone whatever and yes guys that's how this method works if you want more straightforward to the point videos you can subscribe my channel and uh, that's it for today hope you guys see my next video till then goodbye